Here's how you get custom songs and mods for Beat Saber on the Quest U for March 2024. First, you're going to need to go to the MetaQuest app on your phone. Click on the search button. Search for Beat Saber. Click on Beat Saber. Scroll down to more information. Click on the upwards arrow, scroll down, click on the version 1.35, click on the channel live, and then click on the legacy version 1.29 Unity. Next up, boot up your Quest 2, go to Beat Saber, make sure you reinstall Beat Saber. So okay. After using your Meta app to downgrade Beat Saber from 1.35 or whatever the current version is to the version 1.29 Unity, uh, what we need to do is go to the store and find Mobile VR Station, download and install it. Once you do that, we're going to go into Browser. Go to Google. I'm gonna go to yeah, SideQuest. Sign in. Type in SideQuest here. Click on the magnifying glass, click on this guy right here, the one with the SideQuest VR. Scroll down. Go to download APK directly. Click on this one here, the app-release.apk. It's going to download and install. You can go ahead and close the Meta Browser app. And go to library, go to mobile VR station. All right, local files, all, all folders, Android, data, scope storage. Storage actions, request access, bring us to this 2D prompt. We're going to go to Quest 2, and then we're going to go to download, and then we're going to click on the APK, a app dash release dash or dot APK. Click. Did you get this prompt? Click continue, click install. It's now installing. You can install. We're just going to click on the app to release APK again. App installed. And click done. And then close. When you click close, the mobile VR station will close as well. Then we're going to go to the library, click where it says all. Click where it says all, go now to unknown sources, go to side quest. Drag this over to the left. If you're not able to drag the window to your left, make sure you go to quick settings. That's this guy right here. Click on switch distance. This will give you the option for multi windows. And then we're going to click on library. Where it says unknown sources, go to all. We're going to go to the browser at the top, type in the SDQ.st. 
t slash link. It'll take us here. Enter your code that shows there. Six six four five nine seven two. Click link now. Go have fun, you're connected. Yeehaw. So we're gonna close the meta browser now. Bring Psychos over here. It says allow permissions. Go ahead and click allow. And we are going to be clicking on. Uh, I do not see what's that version switcher. So we're going to click on the magnifier in the top right. Type in quest. App version switcher. Go ahead and click all on the we value your privacy and click on sideload. It'll say installing, downloading, zoom, zoom. Reset your phone currently is allowed to install unknown apps. Just go ahead and click settings. Do not click settings again. Click on the window behind. Click on allow from the source. Click on the go back arrow. Click on install. Install it successfully. Go ahead and close SciQuest. Go to library. Click on the all dropdown list. Go to unknown sources. So now we're going to open the Quest app version switcher. Click start. Beat Saber 1.28 has been downloaded successfully. Click mod my game. Sure. Install game, start, uninstall, continue. Okay. Start uninstall. Click install app. There you can see the version 1.29, so you know that going through the app is what we had to do. Click on settings. Don't click settings again. Click behind. Click the toggle on. Click the bottom go back arrow. Click on grant access. Click on install app. Click on install. If you get the restore app prompt, just click on close. Click on grant access. Click on use this folder. Allow, use this folder. Allow. Click on grant access again. It'll now say version 1.28. You know that it did downgrade correctly. Click on allow access to manage all files toggle on. Click the bottom go back arrow. Click continue. Finish. You restored. Excellent. Click close. Now it'll say game modded. Click on get mods. So it's currently installing. Q mod, Q mods. Ah, so these are all the core mods. That's what I was expecting it. Yep, there's your core mods. So you can go ahead and close, open your app library, go to Beat Saber. You might get a few prompts. If it says restore or open, make sure you always click open. If you click restore, it will uh, restore your Beat Saber version back to live. If you get this one, allow permissions, go ahead and click allow.
there's that restore app. Go ahead and click open app. If it does not boot up, click on your meta or Oculus button right there. Find Beat Saber, open Beat Saber, and it should open without any issues. There we go. So I have the one song from when I tested before. Download to download more songs with the left. You can see mods, click on more songs. Find the song you want to play. Click on download. Once it downloads, go to solo. Make sure you click the icon with a hand holding the music note, and then find the song you want to play. 